yeah. yeah. Pick a number one to eight. Seven. Um, seven. Oh, I was going to go for seven. Was you? Oh my God, we're so cute. <laughs> 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 yeah, no, you're a bit. <laughs> Let's just kiss. Let's <laughs> just neck hard. Heard of a show called Milf Manor? Mate, oh. it's four. Have you heard of it? Have you? Oh, oh my god, I've right, never again. seen Milf oh. Manor. Milf Manor is oh. wild. Is it? Is it? So is it a blue good. movie? Oh sure. wait, don't don't spoil it because I want to see if he can get what it is from the trailer because it doesn't spoil what the like okay the thing is. <laughs> oh my god, Milf Manor, right? Yeah, it's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Giving me some purple. I think it's like purple. I want to get a chance to do me a little. Young men have much more energy. They think out of the box. I want that. Especially in the bedroom. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the villa. You're about to embark on a dating experience like none other. Let's go. I have an extremely high libido. Is that too much saying I have an extremely high libido? Should I just subscribe to my libido? <laughs> <laughs> Tom's not excited, he started dribbling. <laughs> First one, two minutes. <laughs> not even a minute. Shaking. Tom's drooled <laughs> and men's abs. <laughs> 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 TLC, Tom loves cock. <laughs> What's this channel, man? <laughs> oh, oh, for so Mil- uh, yeah. on, Do you want to explain what Milf Manor is? Yeah. Oh. Is? Okay, so it said there there's one shock and twist. What do you reckon the twist is with Milf Manor? W- one of them is the mum. <laughs> and what, so one of them is like the son of a, of a mum who's in there. Yeah, you are correct. I know. So they're, they're, they're yeah. all, they're all the... mum and sons. I've watched eight seasons of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're all mum and sons who go. So the sons get to date the other mums, but the mums also have to date the other sons. But like in front of them while that happens. Yeah. It's incredible. Yeah. That's rough, isn't it? That is sick. Yeah. Like, imagine seeing your mum like crack on. <laughs> I know, yeah. That's, like, some, <laughs> that's some like deep level. Someone you went to school. <laughs> <sighs> that's some honestly like deep level Freudian shit there, you know? Mm. Yeah. yeah. So like. That is crazy. It is, and it's weird as well because if it was Dilf Manor, never would happen. No, not a chance. I'd be asking out my dad with a <laughs> ponytail. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what well, was Dilf, not Milf Manor? <laughs> no, that's a great point though. Like, just yeah. put this. Just it would never happen. Do the way around. It would be insane. Yeah. Yeah. I've just seen your mum's moves as well. No, like, no. Your mum just chatting pure conspiracies in the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> just, just, just people openly talking like, oh yeah, yeah, I'm into it. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah, but boss tits and that. You're like. Yeah, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, like to, to describe and the girl, and you're like, yeah, she sounds fifth. You're like, yeah. which one? You points, and it's just your mum's not there. <laughs> That's a rough one. Hey, no, she gives dead good head, and you're like, yeah, yeah, does she? Yeah, and like, yeah. <laughs> which one is it? And then she points to Helen, <laughs> Mama, <laughs> Mama. <laughs> yeah, that's fucked, man. It's gonna be the it. same, was it? No. No, you've got to clap them off to like the secret room. Like, oh, what, <laughs> is, uh, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> ah, it's a horrific show. Oh yeah, go on someone your own age, like dad. What? <laughs> oh. my, but uh, I, it wasn't the one in Sweden, and Nathan Fielder was talking about it, and it was basically um, a dating show where it's a girl who doesn't know a biological dad. Mm. And they have all these fellas, and it's like a bachelor show. One of them is her dad. I'm sure it's something like that. <laughs> oh, no, 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 sorry, sorry. I've got it wrong. I've got it wrong. It's all these different men. Mm. One of them is her actual biological father. Yeah. But the others, are just, the others are trying to convince her that it's them. And she mm, has to figure out who fuck? is it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure that's a real one. I'm sure it is. Nathan Fields was talking In about Sweden. it. Something like that. Yeah, it's like a Swedish one. A lot of them look the same, though. Exactly. Yeah, this, yeah. It, yeah. And apparently, they are, like, a lot of interbreeding just go on just by accident there's an app on your phone isn't there cool. in, in sweden and like norway and in small countries there's an app on your phone so you can know if you're if you've got dna with that person what because there's so much interbreeding going on how did it get that bad there's an app there's not that many of them and these don't like outsiders do they what that's everyone with blue eyes is technically related really yeah that's like an actual thing what about brown eyes brown, nah, and all brown eyes related to all brown eye no Blue eyes are like more rare, isn't it? Mm. You've got blue eyes, haven't you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Aryan. <laughs> Strong Aryan blood. <laughs> Alright, you two. Pit of brownie, but not pit of brownie. <laughs> 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 
Gone down. Gone down. Already. Six minutes. I'm sorry. It's been a racist joke and gay joke. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm fine. I make your eyes. Uh, Miss you know, I haven't seen you for a week. I feel like this is like the longest we've I know, ever yeah. seen each other. I've loved it, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> that hurt my soul. Got him. <laughs> that hurt my soul. Uh, what, what, was, your, was, your, was your gigging? Look at that for the setup, by the way. Oh, that's that's sick. Sick. <laughs> that was so smooth. Was your gigging you last doing night? Your job. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to lie, I ate so much dick last night. Like, I was due a death. <laughs> yeah, no, it was like, no. <laughs> Can you get me on, Callum? <laughs> uh, yeah, I was due a death, and it happened last night in Doncaster. And fuck me, it was like it, it was a like a like a kind of like a private function mm. for, and the organisation was called the Round Table, and they were all like Freemasons. No way. And it was just a room of white people. <laughs> and before I went in, they all had like pie. Sounds like my kind of room. <laughs> yeah, they loved it. They all had like pie and mash. So when I went on stage, I just stunk a pie. And I was like, thanks for bringing me on to the smell of pie. What kind of, <laughs> what kind of pie are we meat talking? Meat potato. Oh. It's okay. It's um, very white. The, the meat of someone who wasn't white. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be in the next dish. Uh, I was like, yeah, it stinks a pie. I was like, if Brexit was a cologne, it would be this room. And they were all like, yeah. Oh. Really? Mate, mad. Very on stage, that cardboard cutouts, like that Hasbulla. I picked them up, I volleyed them off the stage. <laughs> and then this creepy fucker can get away. I kicked them at this. <laughs> there was a woman on the front in a wheelchair. And I kicked Hasbulla like close to her head. And she ended, when I was talking, because I was just getting nothing, I started talking and all her head was like, beep. She started reversing while I was on for, for, with like a gin and tonic. And around, I went, Are you drinking? She was like, Yeah, I went, I hope you're not drink driving. <laughs> Everyone in the room went silent. I was like, sad. I was like, is it one of them, is it? Every time I'd done a joke, one person laughed. And I went, throughout the night, I'm going to do one joke for each of you. I was like, by the end of 20 minutes, you're all going to have one laugh each. <laughs> and then they all just stared at me. I was like, oh, fuck the lot of you. Damn cast today. Yeah, mate, it was bad gig. How did that one come about? Uh, so it was Adam Hughes. Uh, he booked me on it. But it was like, they all knew him. So yeah. they, they like, because he, he, he does gigs like in like random places. Bowling alleys, fucking yeah. disabled, disabled toilets. He's <laughs> yeah, like... wanting to swim in bats once. <laughs> <laughs> um, where else is Adam Hughes? Let's think, of, let's think of places Adam Hughes has put gigs on. Helicopter. Yeah, sewer. <laughs> <laughs> um, hospital waiting room. <laughs> the med lock in. Um, <laughs> just that space in between a pub where you go in the first door and then there's another door that little place with that little yeah. square <laughs> <laughs> there's like someone in there that's an Edinburgh fringe venue <laughs> <laughs> but uh, yeah he's just yeah, I mean respect to him like he, he will gig fucking absolutely anywhere mm. but I've you gotta been, draw a line at it though sometimes yeah I've been I've been bad before do you know what yeah, I mean yeah, yeah. Um, well no I was due that, that was last so night nice. and it was a, a very sober and two hours on the way home just wondering, shall I just go really fast into a wall? <laughs> yeah. Really? The boss though, it's like refreshing, and it? it's like an uh, it's like getting electrocuted, mm. having a nice death. You're like, ooh. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Uh, why? Why am I doing this? I, I, yeah, you, I feel like that's the thing, and you like you got to get good at dying. And last night I was like good at it. Uh, you know what? I mean? but you know what? Yeah. Yeah. In respect of that, I, I agree with that to a point, though, cause, and it is good to die. But mm. at, at certain places, at that, there's no, there's really no like risk. It's kind of like fuck it, you know yeah. what I mean? I'm never going to see these people again. Yeah. But if it's in comedy clubs, uh, or if it's in like yeah. opportunity, like opportunities uh. where like you've, you should, you should really have a good one here, mm. and it goes bad, you're like fucking you will eat that's yourself, the, or a competition or something yeah. like that. Yeah. yeah. That fucks you up. I, I I get stroppy. I get angry, mate. Mm. When I like, if I die on my ass, I'm like, oh, fucking yeah. shit, me. You yeah, know what I mean? yeah. You're right. Them type of gigs, they don't like. It does matter, but it doesn't. Like, I had a woman come up, come up to me after the gig last night and went, "You tried," <laughs> and I went, "Fuck you." Yeah. <laughs> Away, you waddle away, you and your dead eggs. Away, giving me shit. Oh, yeah. Wait, why were there women at the Freemason gig? Uh, they have a lady table, like a lady <laughs> round table as well. So I was like, oh, I was like, what the fuck's that? And they're like, well, it's what ladies go to around the table. I was like, sound, yeah, good chat, guys. <laughs> they were just fucking bored. I always think that. I always think, why why have you asked for comedy? If you, just, <laughs> you know what I mean? Well, it was a charity event for their charity. So they were raising money for themselves. But they're all millionaires. Are they? Made, it was just, in, like, it was like this, like, um, for function, con, room. function room. So mm. It's like a big function room in the middle of, like, a mansion estate. 
fuck off. Like it was yeah. mental. I've noticed that people, like wealthy people, mm. don't take take themselves so seriously. It's hard for them to find joy, yeah, or like humour. Mm. Um, not that I know many fucking millionaires. <laughs> <laughs> um, when I've if I've ever been on a gig with a thing, oh, he's definitely fucking loaded this fella. Mm. You can just tell by the way he's dressing that, yeah, and like the way they carried themselves, and it's kind of like um, they've got like a look on the face, just like it's been enough. okay, funny man. Yeah, take yeah. it away. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean. Not my cup of tea, but you know. Uh. <laughs> it's the ones who try and join in as well. Oh, like there was a guy last night who was trying to join in, but every time he said something, he was looking around, going, uh, oh. "Hey, look what I said." Well, I, I when like, I, I I opened for the, a mate of ours, Harry is a Stakini Shatini. Mm-hmm. I've knew him for fucking ten years, and I always got his name wrong. Shout out Harry, he's a fucking Harry, Harry's, Harry's the boy. Great. Harry's going to be huge, and um, mm. I don't. He, he asked me to open for him in Manchester for his recording, which was boss. It was like two nights of recording. Um, and some of the people in it, I, I was doing a bit at the time about my dad. And like, like, like my dad used to be like a bit of a rogue and like, uh, anyway. Uh, and I'm, I'm talking about my dad's, when he go down on the barge and do like armed robberies and stuff. And I can see this one fell in the front row, like not laughing, but just like amazed kind of thing or just like fascinated. And he came up after the show. And he's like, great show. He's like, is that right about you? Your dad, and I know, yeah, yeah. He was like, yeah, he was a character, and um, he was like, oh, I've got, um, I've got a friend, my friend with a podcast, they love it, but he was a proper posh uh, But you could tell he was just like, no way, you know. Yeah. 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 Crime, you were, you were close to crime, yes. Um, yeah, and he was like all stuck, and I was kind of like, yeah, yeah, it's a bit for him and that. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Playing up to it, yeah, you know. I just I tried to stay out of that life, got myself into stands up and stuff, you know. Because been working out the age, you would have been like seven. Yeah, like, yeah. yeah I'd stay I'm like, like it was common as your jug. You know what I mean, lads? In reality, I'd just be working at open bargains. I mean, like, if I'm gonna, you know, I might as well be. Um, yeah, that was the big sticker, you know, the big skill. <laughs> <laughs> That's hilarious. No, that. The regular ones is a good job, man. Yeah, yeah. It's hilarious, that, isn't it? What a mad tactic. The big sticker. Yeah. Oh, no. Well, they put, like, a black man there, so when, like, all white people walk past, they go, oh. Yeah. 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 Start, also, do you think about throwing one of them fucking imperial leather in your pockets? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you seen what they start doing home bargain now? Oh. Where they've put, like, products behind a little jail. Yeah, in prison. What? <laughs> What's that? They've give, like, uh, like, washing powder and stuff. Like, cause it, cause I live on my own now. I realise that someone doesn't come in and do your washing. <laughs> <laughs> so now, <laughs> boy, <laughs> now I'm going home and bargain, and I'm trying to get like Daz, but it's behind like Daz. Uh, I don't know. Is it Daz? Yeah, washing up partners. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Daz is. I don't Why know. Why you say it like that? I just remember that because it sponsored Emmerdale Like <laughs> ten years ago, it's the only <laughs> that's time what, I ever that's saw it. I don't think I haven't even got Daz. I had to get rid of it because it gave me a skin rash. <laughs> I'm sure, I'm sure I, I doubt it's made anyone. I think it's I've, I've got non, non-bio fairy pouches. <laughs> that's what the I had to get. Pouches are cool. Yeah. yeah. Dying to eat them, aren't you? Oh my god, yeah, I know. <laughs> I thought I was the only one. Time to just go, but it looks like it'd be so <laughs> nice. I know it'd kill me. It's just one can it. You're going for the next record, I'm just foaming from the yeah. mouth. I'm like, just one. It won't yeah. hurt me, man. Um. I'll split it. <laughs> looks sick. But the behind, like, I am like a little cell now. So you can't take anything out. Like, you need to have to get someone to unlock it. Mental. It's like the, the, the putting um, security tags on baby formula as well. Because. Mm. Yeah. Fucking it's expensive. Pe- people it. who can't feed the kids are robbing baby for me, and they're like, "No, you don't." <laughs> That'll be five. Fuck, however much it is. It's tragic that. Yeah. Crazy, isn't it? Let them steal the fucking baby for me, will you? Mm-hmm. I know, but I used to work at Sainsbury's because I've worked absolutely everywhere, and I was on the meat counter. You know what I wore? Like, a a hair. Yeah, you were. I wore like a little hair. <laughs> it, was, it, was, it, was just, it was. It was just me and three hour women. Yeah. And, uh, Did you ever laugh at them though? Nah, they hated me. Why did I was just a little 19 year old potter who was like, and they were like, fuck, he's useless. Um, <laughs> you, what were the names? Can you remember? No, I fucking blacked out, blacked that out. You would have been so funny on that cam. 19, yeah. just me and two fucking 60 year old women. <laughs> it's probably old woman job. Right, that, right next to it? the fish counter as well, stinking. Oh. It was, yeah. Um, started from the bottom. <laughs> started from the fish counter. <laughs> Saves me rice laid. <laughs> So, uh, but I always remember this woman getting like dragged through, like homeless woman, alcoholic must have been, with mm. a bottle of wine. She stole a bottle of wine, and the security guard was like just pulling it, and she was like on the floor. So he's pulling her like by her arms. I was like, come on, mate, bottle of wine. Yeah, you know what I mean. Some fucking models. Yeah, just you got a job. Mm. Yeah, I just take the wine and be like, be gone. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. On your way, you. But he was like, nah, you're facing justice. <laughs> <laughs> so who do you think you are? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Let it go, man. 
uh, what did you get sacked from there for? Yeah, just being off. Oh, I booked a holiday and I went, I went to Amsterdam. Mm. Um, and then she was like, Do you love how I knew he got sacked? He didn't, he didn't even mention that he got sacked. <laughs> <laughs> I just knew he did it. <laughs> Yeah, it's either sacked or walked out. I've yeah, never, yeah. never yeah. entered the job. I'm a, I'm a I love when life. you do your walkouts because I always feel like you think the manager's going to go, no time, <laughs> come back. I'm like, he's going to be sorry. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We're like, you keep getting halfway and then looking back. Yeah. Go, <laughs> That's it. We're doing okay. He's like, sweet. Yeah. yeah, yeah come, on. come on. I'm like, yeah, I'm going now. <laughs> Oh, like that yeah. kid from Wife Swap. You know, the one where he packs his little suitcase. Oh, <laughs> the yeah. one where we're like, we're I remember doing that as a kid. Mate, I don't know what it was. What did you pack? Yeah, just like a, a couple of toys. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I always think of the fact it was a family guy sketch as well where Peter's running away and he goes, What are you doing? And he goes, He's putting toys in a tuna and he goes, he goes, Well I gotta I gotta eat and I gotta have fun. Uh I had I had one undie and uh, a pair of socks. That's all I done. And nice. I just I, I just sat at the top of the road and I was there for Wait a for someone to pick it up and just be <laughs> Free kids. It's like it's a new life now. <laughs> Living off the land. <laughs> Holy man. Uh, uh, Ends up in a kebab shop. <laughs> <laughs> On the spit. <laughs> Just rotating around. There's my son. Uh, <laughs> they find Callum eight years later in Hull. <laughs> and the manager of a kebab shop. <laughs> Crazy accent that he's oh. developed. <laughs> yes, boss man. <laughs> yes, keeps offering people mayonnaise. <laughs> <laughs> Involuntary. <laughs> mayonnaise, boss. Oh, sorry. I mean. <laughs> uh, what's your sexiest music video, by the way? Because oh. it's reminded me when I was... Uh, Go on, you do. <laughs> God, let, let's hear your story. We'll put that song on and then I'll show you mine. Okay, the reason why you brought this up because you need to tell everyone that you. Know. I'm a lesbian, <laughs> okay? Just get that clear. What? Just get. <laughs> Fuck off. You messing? Oh, no, talk. Sorry. <laughs> All right, carry on. Because uh, we were talking about like, being young and that, like, my. <laughs> do you remember Call on Me? Yeah. It's a music video? Yeah. yeah. That was my first, like, proper, like, wank to something. Yeah. yeah. Call on me. Yeah. The drawing. With the drawings, the bit where they go. Oh, uh, no, not that. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'll take a take, take, take on me. Yeah, yeah. I'll take a take on me. me. I was like, fuck. <laughs> Mad dog. <though>. Oh, <laughs> that, bad to be fair. Oh, this Like, we proper, like, less where I had time to myself <laughs> and I could wank. What was this? Just playing on like Viva Music or something? Yeah, but this was like I wasn't nine when I done it though. I think it just come on. But it's when you know when these do do like the little um, the downward dog pose and that. Yeah, I mean, look at me, it's a horny video. Yeah, they spent that when I came. <laughs> <laughs> that armpit. I just tried your best to focus on the one man. Yeah. <laughs> just with my palms. <laughs> Wait, what were you wanking with? I was using my thighs. Have you ever done a thigh wank? <laughs> this uh, is the sexiest video. No, it's not. Do you not it's think? up there, but uh, it's not. Like, just singing this is like a horny little boy and you're like, shit. Oh, I don't know, I, 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 I always like, was mad on Beyonce videos, I always thought they were fit as fuck, do you know Which what I mean? I, you know what I always met? And I was, a lot, I was a lot older, I think I was in secondary school, but that um, Sweet Dreams. Sweet dreams, and a beautiful. She, she's, she's fits as fucking that. Sweet dreams, who's that? Beyonce. All oh, right. Look at me, Beyonce. <laughs> <laughs> Come. <on. laughs> What's this yours? Satisfaction. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God, I'm just really struggling. Okay, you know what? I, I think Liv's beat you here. Yeah, I've, I've 100 percent beat you here. Oh, that nail. <laughs> yeah, nail me. <laughs> Can you open that? You got nails. Nails. <laughs> I've got fingers though, you've been coiled. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I buy my nails. I've got like proper like covers on the tip of my fingers. No, you haven't. Look at that. I've got no nail. Oh yeah. I've you got frog hands. Put... <laughs> <laughs> you got hands like a frog. You can tell fingers. these are gay because they're not paying attention to this fucking thing. <laughs> <laughs> <It's a video. laughs> mm, I've already came. <laughs> 
What about um, <coughs> I mean I, I was never thinking but people went for blade lines for some reason. What was um, blade lines? Blade lines. Robin Thay. Yeah. Well, what was the video? Thick. It was just that beard from Gone Girl. Like, yeah. Not not Rosamund Pike, the other one, the younger one. Mine's well sexier than this. No. We haven't got uh, to the... To be fair, lesbians love building shit. Yeah, these DIY. Happens. DIY yeah. To be fair, this is emasculating me. <laughs> I'm not very good at yeah. DIY. Watching these oh, women. women... can do it for themselves. Bum, bum, it's this one. Bum, 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 oh, I shouldn't bum, do that on the camera, actually. Yeah. I'm still a lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Oh, what's yours? Um... Take on me. Please <laughs> 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 take on me. No, I always do. I always do. Yeah, yeah, actually, yeah. Stop saying the things. But yeah, like, yeah, Beyonce ones used to always do it for me. Uh, what about mm. um, Beautiful Liar with her and Shakira? That was a sexy one. Shakira as well. Mm. Shakira. Yeah. Yeah. I'll be honest. I went. I went like sitting in front of the fucking MTV. To be honest mm. with you, I was just cartoons and yeah. It's wanking to cartoons. I mean, <laughs> like the Tom and Jerry when you can't see that. To be fair, guy, oh yeah. Not wanking to cartoons, but I might, I might have been in the act and a cartoon was on. Mm, and you might have carried on. No, but I'm, I'm just mm. imagination. But then you glimpse up and it's just you're halfway through a Simos episode and you're like, oh, <laughs> didn't mean to include you in this. <laughs> one. Did you ever want to page free? No. Yeah, same. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's scatty that. <laughs> Who wants the page free? I never, I never buy in porno mag- ma- uh, magazine. Yeah, yeah. Zoo. Something. You no, know, no, like a proper fucking thingy one. Oh, like in, our, in, in my local shop. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. When I was v- very young. Okay, you I, stole it. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say you went up to the counter. Yeah. <laughs> All your silvers. No, I used to, I used to like, I used to like help out. I used to like help out in the in the in the corner shop when I was a kid. Hence why I was. Fucking ginormous. <laughs> <laughs> Just sitting there inhaling Mars bars. Yeah. Uh, I thought it was only Zoo. That's the only one I really th- thought. No, was top, top shelf, there was like. Nuts. Fu- yeah, the full. Oh, nuts. Nuts and Zoo. That's that, it, that we were still in that age where like m- magazines were a thing. I feel like we've get experienced on every, everything though. I think we were the last gen. Yeah. We were, yeah. the, I think, 96, 97. Yeah, I'm like. Kind of. 95, sorry. Yeah. Yeah, it's like the last ones where mm. you, you remember not having a phone. Yeah. yeah, and like Facebook or anything, I mean, yeah. you know, not like that. The Nokia yeah, was a thirty. Yeah, you have Snake. Yeah, oh, it's yeah, cool. yeah, yeah. That's cool. Dial up internet and everyone. Yeah, cranking yeah. yeah. <laughs> Makes me feel proud. Uh, yeah. Text them is a nightmare on them Nokia's. We have to like press it and and them like three times just I to get us see. I get it all the time and work, and people come up and they're like, "Can you send a text to me, me daughter in Australia?" And you're like, "Oh my god, this is gonna take me forever because <laughs> she's going to these Nokia's." <laughs> god. Yeah, it's like when they brought the BlackBerry out, you know, you get the keyboard on the phone. Uh, Black- yeah. BlackBerry was huge. Yeah, yeah when the BlackBerry yeah, came out, yeah. you had to have a BlackBerry, man. Oh, like, did you ever, like yeah. one day you just came home and you were like, man, I've got to get this phone. Yeah, and yeah. she was like, what? <laughs> and you were like, I've got to get this mm. 45 year old businessman, like, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. why is this thing called BBM? Uh, and if you're not on it, you're fucking no one, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to have BBM. <laughs> and it was. BBM was like, yeah, I used to think it was crazy. Oh, did you, <laughs> did you ever get like proper like, like <laughs> scream munch? I'll scream munch. <laughs> <laughs> we used to do that to one of our meets. Every time you'd eat food, we'd scream munch because you know, the noise would. <laughs> 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 yeah, did you ever get people coming over to you going, hey, can you just broadcast me pin on your BBM? Oh, yeah, and yeah, then yeah, you would yeah, just tick yeah. their name. So it'd look like you've sent it to That's everyone, hilarious. but it would just go to them. Oh my god, yeah. No. That was that was sneaky that shit. That was though. sneaky You're shit. You're a little snipe. I was a little sneaky <laughs> sneak. That was a sneaky sneak Snide on BBMs. We ain't even broadcasting people's yeah. pins. Mm. Do you ever just put like uh, someone's initials in your in your little yeah. bio thing? Yeah, yeah, and then yeah. Like, yeah, that means I'm, I'm, like, I'm like talking to them. I, and, your, and, your, and your picture like mm. said everything about your personality. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? It'd yeah. be like, who you were listening to at the time. Yeah. Or like, a big yeah. Everson badge in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. boxing gloves. <laughs> Photoshopped in boxing gloves. Because <laughs> <laughs> they, they're my two biggest passions. Yeah. <laughs> I was always quite like self aware in school. I think I was. Fu- I think I was funny even when I was a kid. My yearbook quote was I. I think I'm still proud of it. It's see you in the doll line. Nice, <laughs> which is amazing. Yeah, and I was like, dead proud of that. I never teachers come up going nice. <laughs> so I was like, and I was like, it's a good one, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Genuinely, I'll send you a picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. See you in the doll line. I, I think I, my I think I peaked. <laughs> <The best one. laughs> I've, uh, I got like the lowest ever mark in school in art. 
Like it was that bad they couldn't even grade it. Mm. I got an N in maths. An N? In non applicable. <laughs> wow. Yeah. <I've- laughs> Did you turn up? Yeah. That's even worse. <laughs> you would have got a better mark if you didn't even turn up. <laughs> yeah. I was I was telling him all the way through school. I was like, I really mean. I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. That's so funny. I was like, yeah, yeah, really one hundred percent real as well. Yeah. And like all the way through school, I was like, I really need that with this match. You know, like I just I, I can't look at numbers <laughs> to save my life. I'm like, hard. I'm like numerically dyslexic as well. Mm. Uh, Riddle with dyslexia, man. Yeah. And they were like, just fucking stop being a little knobhead then. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so they just left me, man. Yeah, they just fucking <laughs> left me, and all other kids were getting help and shit. You know what I mean, like oh. writers and stuff. And I got help. I used to be in the special section in the test. Yeah, I was in special needs. Used to get extra time, and I was in SN. No, no, I, I think they just didn't like me, so they were like, uh, "Man, I'm probably fuck just you saying in your future. <laughs> yeah, they probably weren't even thinking about me. Yeah, but you said you're gonna be on a dollar line, so they were like, <laughs> "Yeah, but mm, yeah." But I mean, obviously, that was before all your testing shit. But I remember being like, "I'm, I don't know what I'm looking at here." I was that. I'm that dumb. I'm that dumb, man. Mm. All the shit like was like, um, Sarah's got seventeen pineapples. She gives eight away. <sighs> well, and she gets months. two back, <laughs> and then she grows seventeen. <laughs> I'm like, well, what? 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 What are you asking me? Know, what yeah. do you want from me? <laughs> Why are you ca- <laughs> who's counting the pineapples? Yeah, yeah. By the way, you're not making this easier. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Because you're making it like, oh, I bet. I look, you know what I used to love the way they'd like try and make it. Inclusive, oh, yeah. so that it clearly be like you know what I mean. Ishmael's Ishmael's name. Ishmael has fourteen pound, and you're like, what the fuck? Ishmael's still a cunt though. <laughs> Ishmael or Sarah, you're both cunts. Yeah. I don't care. <laughs> you fucking pineapples. Yeah, I really struggled so in school, but I, I liked and, and I, was, I was I was interested in. I was really good at. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Creative shit. Yeah, um, and stuff. But I was just, I was a nightmare. For, for teachers if, if I weren't interested uh, so yeah. I'd just distract a little attention so you get hence the stand up comedy and this shit yeah. do you know what I mean <laughs> <None of this> <laughs> <shit>. <laughs> I'm just a proper little attention so you come uh, on that's all there is at the end of the day did you ever figure out that if you made your teacher laugh you can get away with oh, yeah. stuff or oh, you just God. got them you got them talking about something they liked yeah, oh, yeah. 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 and just yeah. distract them for yeah, the whole absolutely. thing yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah we had an RE teacher in um, my school who loved to talk about um, when she was pregnant and gave birth. So literally every class mm. we'd sit down, she'd be literally this close to the whiteboard and be like, Miss, how long did it take you <laughs> to, to get labor? <laughs> well, we arrived at the hospital. And then we're just like, okay. And then next <laughs> week, you see them go like, shit, shit, right? Okay, <laughs> we've got to do something now. <laughs> You're like, the no, no, no. <laughs> oh. Great times. Yeah, I had it with uh, my science teacher. I handed in like homework so late, and um, I never had homework. Did you not? Sorry. Did you ever get homework? No. Sorry, go on. why though? Uh, I, I think they were just like, yeah, it's a lost course. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> That's so tragic. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, sorry. Did, did you uh, did you ever do the history homework? Like history stuff where you had to do like a scroll or something from like like back in the day. Oh, you had to get tea bags and stuff. That was like yeah. everyone's yeah. go to, and it just tea bagged the shower paper <laughs> with just a document from Wikipedia. <laughs> My, the Wikipedia done my homework for me. Yeah. The amount of stuff I put on there. I had my science teacher. I was like handing homework in. And I was like, oh, I miss him. So sorry. And she went, it's, it's just it's just too late. And I went, it's too late to apologize. <laughs> and she just burst out laughing. And then ever since then, I just, like, she, like, she just got me. Oh, no. Do you know what I mean? Like, I just got away with so much shit. Late, I got that would have been huge back then as well. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, I was doing GCSE science and I was that bad. They dropped me to BTEC science. Aww. And like, she pretty much done all my work for me because she was like, you're just a lost cause. Like, you're useless. And then I still failed. So, my GCSEs are tragic. We had a, we had a construction class, which is probably one of the funniest classes I've ever been in. Construction? In yeah, because it, it, it was a technology college also. So, yeah. In year, going into year, what was it, yeah, or, or year 10, 11, you do, you, 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 you do your options, mm. and I did construction was one of them, and we had like, you do brick laying and shit, and painting and decorating and stuff like that, but it was literally just every little rat bag from mm. the year, do you know what I mean, just lads who were like, yeah, construction, yeah, 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 and uh, it was just bedlam, just mayhem, <laughs> hammers getting thrown, <laughs> fucking fights, every, every, every lesson to be a fight, to be a full on fist fight, yeah. um, just the most rootless like, fucking like, with just, weapons as well though, oh yeah, yeah, hammers just getting thrown at people <laughs> and stuff like that, paint, paint getting thrown at people's faces, people are flipping fucking start fighting, and I remember the teacher, can't remember his name, and he hated us, and he was he's just like, 
like almost like we said in his hands and he'd be like he used it all gonna amount amount of fucking nothing and we'd be like ah! <laughs> <laughs> shut up sir it was you know looking back you were like fuck he must have uh, he must have dreaded that class yeah. every fucking like other day he must have just been like I can't fucking deal with these kids um, and people would just test you mm. do you know what I mean because it was the absolute like waste of the waste in that year so just like you fucking did, 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 people just see how far they could push each other mm. before something would happen so like your nan starts going then your Ooh, man then like if you're like no. the baby in the school and it gets to that uh, like, it was yeah it was it was funny like think, thinking about it but um, yeah I remember this one time there was a lad who I actually went to primary school with mm-hmm. uh, his name's Joseph and yeah. um, shout out Joseph Joseph <laughs> yeah I'm not I was, I was no, no point but people used to call him Chewy anyway and um why Chewy? I don't because he used to like do that with, his, with the inside of his mouth. He used to like bite the inside of his mouth. I don't know. Oh, it was a stupid reason anyway. <laughs> <laughs> but we're in construction. We're doing paint and decorating this one time, and um, he like Joseph must have got some paint on his face. Mm. So he goes over and what he's washing his face in the sink, and another lad goes, "Hey, get on Chewy having a bath." <laughs> like, but he was like one of them. He was like, he must have looking back. He was clearly a bit autistic because he uh, just get dead quiet and he mm. just start breathing heavy. Uh, and everyone was like, "Shit, he's gonna fucking kick mm. off here!" And he so he just starts going. Like, <sighs> 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 I start like walking around the room. Like, what do you think? Oh, he's gonna cause murder. So there, there used to be like a like a uh, like a security door almost like a fire door. Mm. And he's fuming and he flips and like he flips the table. And then as he's walking, like, storming out the room, he goes to slam this door behind him. But it's a fire door, so it doesn't slam. So he goes to slam the door, and it's just got like a little window <laughs> with chicken wire in. But as he goes to slam the door, it goes. <laughs> oh! <laughs> and it goes, and everyone wins. Oh! That, so is so that is so embarrassing. That is so embarrassing. It was just the way this all went because you were like. And he went, <laughs> and, <laughs> and he went. We all laughed. And then he turns around and he just went, <laughs> and he put his hand through the fucking window with oh, chicken wire. Oh. And we all just <laughs> <laughs> silence. And we were like, oh. no one wanted Joseph up. Fucking yeah. you know. That is rough. It was, I was just at security, it's always the fucking funniest thing ever. <laughs> That's so funny. Uh, we had a blind girl in our school. Oh. She was in my year. But she never had like a carer, so she'd just like wander around <laughs> and that. And, uh, really? So you had a blind girl? Just one blind girl in the school? We had one, yeah. Why did you have more than one? No. <laughs> Usually they're in like separate education, aren't they? Uh, eh, no, because she, she, well, she was in my music class. She's just visually impaired, but she's one of them kids with like an eye patch. Well, I think I think every now and again she would like open her eye like that to see if anyone was looking. Uh, and then she'd close. But she had no glasses, so she was like full on like, like owning it. Uh, um, and in one of our music classes, like she walked in and went, walked into a drum kit. And it committed. She's really committed to this bit. Yeah, and it <laughs> was so funny. <laughs> like, do you know when you're not allowed to laugh in a classroom, and it's funnier. Oh my god! Mm. Yeah, and everyone was just like, all you could hear was <laughs> like just people swallowing laughs. But yeah, she just roam around. She would walk into <laughs> random classrooms and that. Um, and there's no way she didn't have an escort, lads. There's no <laughs> way. <laughs> she might have. Dogs, but she probably didn't see her. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way this school are just gonna let this poor blind girl just roam the fucking Mate, halls. She was r- I don't even know if she went to our school. <laughs> <laughs> like she was, she was just about like undercover boss. <laughs> <laughs> she was, she was just about. She's like, what's for tea today? <laughs> oh, everyone's like, oh, everyone starts to be asking a lot. What? Just ask. <laughs> Don't tell you. Uh, Thinking of all the food. <laughs> Ooh, everyone's like, no, not off. again. Uh, oh. Did you ever have any uh, things in school that got like banned that you weren't allowed to do? Do you know what I mean? Sorry, hate crimes, they weren't, they weren't too big on the hate crimes. No. <laughs> <laughs> guns. Yeah. Guns yeah. and knives. Sell of weed. These are oh. yeah. currently oh, yeah. on. SWAT not. Oh, yeah, that's funny. Oh, you might have called this something different over yeah. here. SWAT? Oh. Yeah, so you just pull someone's tie. Because if you had a tie, like, that was Ooh, like, that was like tight yeah. and long, then you'd be called a SWAT. So everyone used to have like the little mini ties. Yeah, like yeah, a tie yeah, yeah, like yeah, that yeah, big. Yeah. <laughs> Because apparently that looked better. <laughs> like, just Imagine a little chode around Imagine your neck. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But that got banned because some kid swat knotted someone and then slapped them. And then everyone was like, Ugh, like you can't swat knot anymore. Not that it was like, you're allowed to do it. But yeah. since that's, then. That's first class bullying, man. Yeah. That's first class. That's, I mean, horrible, mm. yes. 
Yeah. Top class bullying. Absolutely. There was so yeah. many bullies Can't in the school. Can't deny that. Uh, yeah. That was, yeah. Oh, yes, what, uh, jelly leg. Like. Oh, yeah, jelly leg. Like. Jelly leg. Did you, what do you call it? We, you know, we go behind someone, you oh, just like... Um, wobbler. 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 Mm. When, you, when you put your knee in the back of the knee. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. wobbler. Oh. Yeah. Um, yeah, <laughs> we had a big guy called Sam, and he was like 6'3", in like year nine, and he was at the vendor machine, and a lad went behind him and jelly-legged him, and as he felt, his knee dislocated, and it oh. wrapped around his leg, and he was just <gasps> screaming. Oh. <laughs> and everyone was like, ooh, yeah, we should stop doing that now. <laughs> I'm like, this isn't good. <laughs> oh. Yeah, and then you could just hear like his Maltese, is like, <laughs> did you... <laughs> I was, I was remember in our school was, there was some, uh, we had mentors in our school so we weren't like they weren't teachers yeah. they were kind of like if you're having a tough day go and speak to the mentors you know what I mean mm. and it was this one called Kaz and she used to because she, <laughs> anytime she'd go in the yard people would just throw shit at her. <laughs> 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 why? why? <laughs> She was just like an idiot, an idiot for you, you know what I mean? Like like a mentor. And as soon as she stepped foot, foot in the yard, people, <laughs> it, cows, people, yeah. people would be like, why am I throwing her? <laughs> Sounds like natural bullshit, you know, to the point where she went on the yard with a fucking umbrella. <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't know if anyone, if anyone, it's <laughs> <laughs> fucking rough. <laughs> if anyone, I know for a fact there's, oh. there's, I've had a couple of messages from people who used oh. to go to my school oh. saying they watch the podcast. Please confirm oh. this oh if you can. Kaz, yeah, Kaz used to have to have an umbrella at, at break time, oh, so, rough, so she didn't get Lucas aid bounced off. Of it. <laughs> There was always that one teacher you know just got uh, terrorized. terrorized. We had, we had, yeah, we had. What did you have like in your in your ceiling in your classrooms with like the panels? Uh, yeah, 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 you could lift out. But what, one of the teachers, <laughs> um, what some what someone done was like she, she went out to like next door classroom to like get like pens or whatever, and then when she went out, someone lifted one of the the pallets off in the ceiling and put a remote control car in there and closed the panel over again. Some Bart Simpson <laughs> shit, that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> when she come in, she was like teaching last night, you could hear, it was like, zzz, zzz. <laughs> <laughs> like massive rats. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a big bee. <laughs> <laughs> Someone bounced a 2 off red as well, that was rough. <clears throat> a 2 <laughs> Toupee. Yeah, it's the Wirral in it. Toupee. I know, yeah. I didn't I didn't think he meant a coin. Um yeah man. Yeah, we have money over there, don't we? We just like fucking ends of butties and stuff like that. Remember one but one last bite of this butty and then his mentor's getting it. Yeah. Do you ever do you ever think you gave you ever gave anyone a hard time? Like when you look back and you think, oh maybe I was a bit too fucking um, yeah you know. maybe yeah. yeah like i was never see i was one of these where i was always if i can make a bully laugh then i'm sweet uh, so if i'm i was always like in the group of like shit going on but i was never like, I was, like you were like you were like the little henchman like, <laughs> like, laughing no, like randall, randall. Get him. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah like i was just i'll say i was never really out like playing out much like a play of time and not that's one thing I got fucking like the piss stuck at me for because I called it playtime in secondary school. It's funny. Like year seven, I was like, "Hey, sir, when's playtime?" And I was like, <laughs> 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 "Fucking nerd." <laughs> uh, but no, I don't know if I gave any. I mean, I might have. I think unintentionally because yeah. I feel like apparently everyone is bullied and is a bully. At yeah. some stage growing up. Mm. Yeah, there's like the the collective collective mentality yeah. in it. Like yeah. there's one kid and you just go along with it. Yeah. It's like, yeah, oh well yeah. if I stick up for them then I'm getting it. Yeah, <laughs> like, there was one kid who got bullied by like the school. Which was tough. By her whole school. The whole there was one time of playtime when <laughs> everyone was chasing him. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, he's you know, the fucking Indiana Jones getting chased by the tribe. Just. <laughs> just fucking. Like, 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 kids. <laughs> but, like, because we were kids, no one understood that you could, like, cut him off. So, like, we're at, like, so everyone was just behind him. So, like, like Benny Hill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh so, we were just doing laps to the playground. <laughs> <laughs> Was a joining in the dinner lady was in there. 
<laughs> just scared of this bro <laughs> Just scared of him. <laughs> Comes over, he's like, I don't want to go to school. Spot him up. Why, son? Is that a boy? <laughs> it's so tragic. Like, it's so horrible. <laughs> what, what happened to this? Is, is this someone bullied yet? Every single person. You need to punch the bully. <laughs> There's 700 of them. It's like, you know, like the film 300. There's like 300 Spartans against the full Persian army. Oh, that's a crime. It's so oh funny. This poor kid's just like, no, oh, he's on as a stance. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Yeah, it was really sad, that. Do you mean everyone? <laughs> oh, yeah. He was very outnumbered. Uh, <laughs> that's fucking brutal. Yeah, he just got chased. <laughs> <laughs> to what end? <laughs> to do what to him? Do you know what I mean? No, 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 no one caught him. No one caught him. Fast. Oh my god. Oh, that's so funny. Yeah, oh. sad that. Oh. 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 <laughs> 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 Okay, no, what's this? Um, did you have a night out recently? Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, this is why I didn't speak to you for twenty four hours because you were all like talking about like, podcast stuff. Like, you go, you go on mad ones. Yeah, yeah. Animal just go out and you just won't hear from him for like forty eight hours, and then he's like, <laughs> yeah, I get so carried away. So I was, I was gigging in Leeds, and then I got home at half nine, and then went straight out, uh, and then didn't get home until six in the morning. Um, and I ended up going to Pogues and uh, Meatball Molly was there. Oh, yeah. Oh she got me in a headlock and played spoons off my head. <laughs> <laughs> as soon as I walked in, I just walked in and she went. <laughs> and you've just got a UFC fighter, a legitimate yeah. UFC fighter. How sick that does. I was going, hi, I got my Molly, hi. That's sick that does. She's saying that you've been yeah, checking yeah. out a UFC hey. fighter and she's played the spoons off your head. tap out either. <laughs> That's funny, that was. Uh, um. But yeah, so we had like a mad night out. So we went like Pogues. Uh, Paul Smith was there. Nice. Uh, shout out Paul, you should check him out if you've never heard of him before. <laughs> I think he's going to be really big. Yeah, yeah, I like him. I, I, yeah, I, yeah. so yeah. under the radar. He's so under the radar. <laughs> you just need to keep going, man. Yeah, yeah. yeah, he'll get there. He'll get there. <laughs> um, yeah, he just needs to cut that Iron Maid shit. The what? And then you know, when he says, like, Iron Maid. He's like, Iron Maid. I, I haven't watched much of him, to be nah. fair. But I, I've, I've seen him once or twice. You'll see him on the Mondays. Uh, so I do Hot Water Mondays. Uh, it's like the open mic nights where I host and stuff. And Paul Smith's always there. Like, just tr- like you know, he's just trying to get there. It depends. It, well, there's 12 people. He either gets yeah. on or he doesn't. <laughs> he doesn't, it's, yeah. It's a fair... Mm. It's a fair pull of the game so yeah you know you it's just the, the stuff he does is so offensive <laughs> have you seen the bit we does with the eyes what does he do chinese eyes mate he's got this new bit with chinese eyes i love it, I love it with it, but i mean it's someone to just do you know <laughs> what i mean bit of, mental, bit of mentorship like yeah, yeah. yeah it depends what way he's pulling the eye you can probably it's probably context you can probably get it to work if he's just mm. like not you know anyway yeah yeah you know, it's young it's the black and up was the, the major <laughs> issue that up, yeah. Mate, it was bad, you know. It was during the break as well. He wasn't even on stage. <laughs> red lips or not red lips? <laughs> no, red, li- red lips. Yeah. Shit. I mean, if you're gonna do it, that's problem. Yeah. That's you have to red lip it. <laughs> <sighs> but anyway, check him out. He's gonna do really well. But yeah, he was there. <laughs> oh, I've, I think I found the hangover drink. Oh, nice. It's a uh, lemon vodka. Um, I think there's like a lemonade type of thing in it as well. In the morning? Mate. So I went for breakfast straight after that night out. Went to the, on the docks, what's the place on the dock? Um, the lounge one. Oh, that's nice. Um, yeah, um, yeah, I'm on it. Brasco Lounge. Yeah. Lovely there was day, a yeah. guy who worked there and I think he's onto the pod. Oh, sick. Because he looked at me and went, ah, like that. He said something about a podcast, but I couldn't really hear him. Mm. And then when I was going to the bar, I was like, I need like a, like, you know, when you get like a pub Coke. And it's like uh, the so like the so yeah. the thing like it's different it's like a normal coke yeah. isn't it? Yeah. I love, yeah. So I was like stood there and he was like, "Do you drink?" And I was like, "Yeah." And he went, "Well, someone just ordered these cocktails and it's the wrong ones." He went, "Do you want them?" And I was like, "Yeah, come on, I'll have two of them." So then I uh, had, what, what time's this? Um, about ten. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> Why? It just what did he say? This is good for a hangover, or did he just offer you two cocktails at ten in the morning? And you said yeah. You could probably see that look like shit. <laughs> <laughs> like this guy needs <laughs> needs a cure. But I'm not lying. As soon as I had that cocktail, I was like straight on it. Yeah, I was debating with myself for cocktails. That's that's, that's the trouble though, because it, all it's doing is people go, oh, here's the dog, sort you out. It's kind of just getting you back in the mood for it. Yeah, it's like such a dangerous game, mm. you know. Really, 
Yeah. Um, it does sort you out. Yeah, when people go like, I can have another one, speaking of which. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> well, gone. Um, yeah, but yeah, but I didn't end up going back out, to be fair. I ended up staying in. But I, that could have been, you know, when you go out where you've had no sleep and then you're going to end up out later again. Do you ever get like, um, hit, hit like, you can hit a wall, but then you, if you get past that wall, yeah. then it's like no man's land. Like, this mm. could go one way or the other. I went to fucking um, in my local, which is like a boss pub. I really want to go to this place, by oh the way. God, it's mad. Every time it's you go, massive. you've always got like a mad story. I was, well, on Fridays, there's £1.50 for a pint. Fuck off. It's £1.50 for a pint of Budweiser Ooh. on Fridays. I walked in with a tenner, like, I've got like a fucking I've got thumb fingers. <laughs> like a proper emperor walked in with yeah. a tenner and was like, and put three behind the bar. And... <laughs> um, <laughs> Someone came in who also watches the podcast and uh, he, he was there on Monday. Oh. He, he was in the audience on Monday night. Oh, shit. Um, and then, yeah, it just all fucking went pee tongue. Mm. And all of a sudden, I was getting in, being sick. And then, oh. yeah, yeah. And that was not yesterday, the day before. What so, are you, you throw ups like? Are you, do you dry heave for a bit? No, I'm, I'm a loud, I'm a loud vomit. Oh, are you one of them ones? I'm a <laughs> Ramona. <laughs> <laughs> like not a lot of guy can really just I reckon you throw up like you know like on Team America <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just oh heavy. my god that's one of the funniest scenes in the world <laughs> but, it's, but it's the woman going you've given up my life haven't you you bum <laughs> and he's like lying on his own sick Lisa Lisa oh uh, what a film blah, 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 blah. Mm. so funny that uh. I, have you ever tried to show someone Team America when they've never seen it before? Yeah, it's hard. And you've got to it? talk them into it. So you're yeah. like, so it's puppets mm. that are the whale police and, and you got to watch it and then you get to the sex scene mm. and they're like, what is this film? <laughs> and you're like, isn't it funny? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best. Absolute best. Uh, also, it's been the guy who um, said he watches the pod. I want to shout out Elliot. Oh yeah, Navy yeah. Seal Elliot. Navy Seal Elliot. Uh, he said he listened to the podcast. Appreciate you, mate. So he listens to the barracks. He also said that he was on a turret shooting down pirates <laughs> uh, while listening to us. <laughs> so, That's so mad. I cool love that. You know, yeah. Yeah. I love it. I've met him. I met yeah. him once before. And um, I know, sorry, I think I've met him a couple of times. He's, he's friends with Danny Davies. Yes. Yeah. And um, yeah, we so we know someone in the Navy. So yeah. So back the fuck, fuck this, off. Yeah. Back the fuck off, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Come for you. <laughs> what was the um, what was the strange addictions thing? Oh yeah, mm. pick a number one to eight. Because the there is there is so many. It's like on TLC again. <laughs> Seven. Um, isn't T isn't isn't TLC a, a girls band? Yeah, <laughs> it is. Yeah, it was some sick girl band back in the day. All Saints, Pure Shores. What do they sing? Pure Shores. Sing it, sing the song. Yeah. I need her on though. I know the words, but I, I get the nerves. <laughs> Hi. Can I try and size and one of the jean jackets with the bling on it? Clothing shopping is the hardest thing on the planet. What's happened to my red? Oh, it's just weird. Oh my god, it fits. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Such, this, that's sad, you know. It's actually sad. So it's really fun working with her. And I think my back's in bits. Imagine what her husband's supposed to be like. Oh, I feel sorry for her. Why? Because she's clear. She's not well. She's done that. I know. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on. Just give her a handheld mic. I know, yeah. Just stick it in between. Give, give her a, but they, they've Please. done this. Yeah. Oh, yeah this will be yeah. funny. Yeah. They know what they're doing. <laughs> this fella's just like, I'm just funny. Stick this right here. I'm going to put my dick right there. <laughs> She's addicted to them. What's that mean? She has them. Is she also addicted to I don't know. She's she that I could be in Vegas. That's crazy. That. I, I wonder what size they are as well. Like. I am from Detroit, Michigan. Do you want to tip over? Mate, what's your cough I'm going to look like? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you have to burn it. You know where like, they burn elephants when they die? Because <laughs> 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 you. 
then he went, she's getting jammed in the creative. Oh, she's not. It's not the basket. People don't think about that. Elephants die. Which is sad. Right? Elephants die. I'm not calling it an epic deal. Wow. Yeah. Elephants die, so they cremate them in him. In huge, like a pit, fucking things. No, not like a pit. It's more sophisticated than that, I imagine. Oh, it's chaos, yeah. huh? Oh, it's a little bit. Little midget, then. Right? <laughs> <laughs> we see one man any time. We get that excited. Like, hey. wrestles. <laughs> We've got to watch the show. Yeah, we need to. By the, can, can you Google, please, um, Micro Wrestling True TV? So I don't think we've actually spoke about Micro Wrestling yet. That's we've been released on an episode. <laughs> so many times. So we love Micro Wrestling, <laughs> and it's the greatest thing that's ever been created. I'm sure we've definitely mentioned it. It, it hasn't been released in an episode. Because pro- if you're following yeah. the Instagram, you're probably wondering why. It's only <laughs> The only things we follow are our accounts and Micro Wrestling. Because <laughs> it's the only thing worth following. Yeah, there's, yeah. There's, been no, there's been no talk <laughs> in like an episode that's been released. Oh my God. So yeah. shout out Micro Jackson. You're oh, my favourite yeah, wrestler. Yeah, Do yeah, us a favour, click, well. click Ivar. This is because he's one of my favourites, Ivar the Micro. No, 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 sorry. Uh, the, 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 the one, that one, yeah. Because uh, they've, they've got a TV. I have broken over a hundred bones in my body. And my child Not the one on my dick. Was to be a wrestler. In Pigeon Forge. I, I actually loved them. I actually fucking loved them. I mean, it's not, I'm not just being like, well, oh, it's midgets. Yeah. They're sick. Yeah, they're, they're yeah. fucking sick. They're fun. Man. There they are, look at them. This business is rough. Our bodies were not made to be thrown the way they were. I have an opportunity to show that I'm just as good as anybody else in this world. Bam. Bam. I've got to watch the can't wait to watch this show. I hate, I don't like Psycho though. I don't like him. He scares me. <laughs> Little shout. Little show. Ivar, man. Mm. I have a I mean, sings. Yeah. He's one of those. He's an ill singer. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't Stop it, nothing. We need them to come to Liverpool. Yeah. We need to go there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep messaging them when I'm drunk. <laughs> I'm gonna <laughs> keep sliding it. I might have. I haven't, I haven't even checked what messages I sent that night. <laughs> big little brawlers. Big little brawlers. Shout yeah. out, Michael Wrestling. Michael Wrestling come to Liverpool, shit, please. Man. No, I, I'm, I'm gonna go to them. I'm kind of, I'm, I'm gonna go to them. I just want us to do a podcast with the money. Oh. Imagine if they come to Liverpool and we got one of the money. And then we do like a wrestler match with them, <laughs> like three v one. I reckon I we can take. I reckon we can take him. <laughs> little, little psychos get his. I'm gonna find psychos. Oh, let's just let's just cut a promo on them right now. Let's just cut <laughs> a wrestler promo on them right, 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 right now. Out. I'm talking to you, little <laughs> you. <laughs> you and me, brother. <laughs> Anytime, any place, right now. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah. It's the fucking oh, best. I just love them. Absolutely love them. Yeah. <laughs>